Bonjour et bienvenue, c'est la modéliste, and I am so glad that you are back here in my channel. For today's tutorial, we are going to learn the part 2 of corset top pattern making. This corset top is heavily inspired by Medusa corset top by Versace. And if you guys didn't know, I've already created a corset top pattern making and it's available in my channel. Better watch the first corset top pattern making so that you will have knowledge or background regarding the corset top pattern making. Anyway guys, let's get this tutorial started. To begin the corset pattern drafting, prepare a sufficient amount of pattern paper. On your paper, trace your basic bodice block with one dart on the side seam. From the bust line starting at the center front line, mark up 2.2 inches or 5.6 centimeters for the neckline of the corset. And square a line connecting these marks. And extend this line towards the side seam like so. Next, from the tip of the waist dart, draw a vertical line passing through the chest line. From this line at the neckline, mark out 3.5 centimeters or 1.3 inches. From this mark, draw a vertical line passing through the chest line. From this line at the neckline, mark up 8 cm or 3.1 inches. From this mark, mark out and mark in 0.25 inch or 0.6 cm. This allowance is for the strap of the corset. From the underarm side seam, mark down 2 cm or 0.75 inch. And connect this mark with the strap mark near the armhole using a curved ruler like so. On the left angle between the vertical line and the neckline, square out a 45 degree diagonal line. From this line, mark out 4.5 cm or 1.7 inches. From the center front line at the neckline, mark in 3 cm or 1.1 inches. And connect all marks starting from the strap mark towards the mark at the neckline, drawing an inverted arc shape for the front neckline. Next, from the new armhole, mark in 7.6 cm or 3 inches. From this mark, draw another curve line towards the bust point. From the bust line at the center front, mark down 1 cm or 3 eighths of an inch. And from this mark at the center front, mark in 1.27 cm or 4 eighths of an inch. From the bust point, draw another curve line until the mark at the center front. This will complete the whole arc pattern for the neckline. Now let's work on the waist or the lower part of the corset. Extend the center front line downwards. Next, from the waistline at the center front line, mark down 8 cm or 3.1 inches. And connect these marks by drawing a line for the hem. From the center front line at the hemline, mark in 4.5 cm or 1.7 inches. Next, get the value or measurement of the waist dart and record. We will distribute this measurement for the new darts of the corset. Next, from the bus point, draw a slant line towards the mark at the hemline. Next, erase the old waist dart to avoid confusion. From the first slant line at the waistline, mark in the half of the value of the previous waist dart. 
and from the bus point, draw a slant line towards the mark at the waistline, completing the first dart for the corset. Next, balance the length of each dart legs and use the first dart leg as a reference for the measurement and transfer this measurement on the second dart leg and mark. From the first dart at the waistline, mark in 5 cm or 2 inches. From the underarm side seam, mark in 2 cm or 6 eighths of an inch. Next, temporarily close the side seam dart. And connect the armhole mark to the mark at the waistline with a slant line for the first leg of the second dart. Next, from the first dart leg at the waistline, mark in the half of the value of the previous waist dart. From this mark, draw the second dart leg until the bust line as shown. From the first dart leg of the second dart, draw a convex line. From this line, draw a concave line towards the second dart leg of the first dart. Next, balance the length of each dart legs and use the first dart leg as the reference for the measurement and transfer this measurement on the second dart leg and mark. From this mark, draw a line blending towards the waistline at the side seam. From the neck point, draw a slant line towards the bust point. From this line, either mark in or mark out 2 eighths of an inch or 0.6 cm. And from this mark, draw another slant line towards the bust point. From the armhole at the chest line, draw a slant line towards the bust point. From this line, either mark in or mark out to weights of an inch or 0.6 cm. And from this mark, draw another slant line towards the bust point. From the center front line at the neckline, mark in 1 eighth of an inch or 0.3 cm. From this mark, draw a slant line towards the hemline at the center front line. Next, remove the excess from the center front. Close the contour at the neckline. And close the contour at the armhole. And bend and blend the neckline and the armhole. Next, cut the front patterns out from your paper. And these are the front patterns of the corset. For the back corset pattern, just simply trace the back bodice until the waist. For the back corset pattern, we'll use the existing darts from the back bodice. From the underarm side seam, mark down 2 cm or 6 eighths of an inch. And from the bust line at the center back line, mark up 2 cm or 6 eighths of an inch. And connect these two marks by drawing a horizontal line. From the center back line at the neckline, Mark in 2.5 cm or 1 inch. Next, from the center back line at the waistline, mark in 2 cm or 6 eighths of an inch. And 
connect these marks by drawing a vertical line. And disregard the excess. Next, balance the length of each dart legs and use the first dart leg as the reference for the measurement. And transfer this measurement on the second dart leg and mark. From this mark, draw a slant line towards the waistline like so. From the second dart near the side seam, extend a line towards the neckline from the end or tip of the start. From the first dart leg of the first dart, mark out 47 inch or 1.27 centimeters. This mark will be our notch reference for the strap. Next, cut the back patterns out from your paper. And these are the back patterns of the corset. And do not forget to label each pattern piece. Et voila! So this is my front corset mock-up. By the way guys, I will create a sewing tutorial for this corset, so stick around for the part 2. Anyway guys, I hope this tutorial gave you an idea on how to pattern draft the corset pattern inspired by the Medusa corset by Versace. And if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to comment down below and I will reply as soon as possible. And if you like this video, please give it a huge thumbs up. And if you super like this video, please give me a super thanks. And if you're not subscribed yet to my channel, La Modelist, make it sure to hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys again on the next tutorial. A bientôt!